This video is presented by local realtor Mandy Gregg, a proud supporter of the Cambridge Red Hawks. Mandy is passionately committed to a personalized approach and providing exceptional service when helping you buy or sell your home. Contact Mandy at 226-755-0200 or visit mandygregg.com. Saturday night GOJHL action from Cambridge. The Red Hawks finishing up their regular season on home ice as they get set to take on the Caledon Bombers. First period of this one in Cambridge striking first. Aiden McCartney, he's going to tip that puck out front. McCartney's got his seventh of the season and just four minutes into this first period, it's 1-0 Cambridge. That's where we would sit after 20 to period two we go. Red Hawks keeping it coming on the offense. Owen Yager's point shot gets through, comes back out front. Zach Gratton right there to bury it. Gratton's got his fourth of the season. He's off the schneid as he tosses the monkey into the seats. Gratton has Cambridge up to nothing. Still in the second period, more Cambridge action out front, cutting to the goal, little shovel pass toward the net. Maddox Niswaski makes the save and all heck breaks loose out front of the Kaladin goal. Niswaski taking exception to the late jabs he received. Everybody grabs a partner. It stays 2-0 Cambridge until a point shot gets through. Max Massarolo gets a stick on it out front. Cambridge is staked to a 3-0 lead still in the second period. Now midway part of the second frame. Caledon on the power play. Doesn't matter. Jack Martin walks in and rips a shorty. Martin has his 17th of the season. Cambridge running away with this one in the second period. It's 4-0 Redhawks. To the third period we go. Still 4-0 Cambridge until a centering pass out front. Jack Martin, no mistake. He's got his second of the night for Cambridge, and the Red Hawks go up 5-0. That would be plenty for Cambridge in this one. Backstop by Leland Gill, who had a 26-save shutout, including this one late in the third period as he covers the loose puck. Gill, excellent. Cambridge heads into the playoffs on a winning note. They'll face the three-seed Elmira Sugar Kings as that series kicks off Wednesday night from Elmira.